and another video on the e-bike. So I bought the battery from AliExpress from a company called Unit Pack Power. And it is a dolphin style battery case and is the one that will fit this frame when you remove the universal bar on it. The one I picked was the 52 volt 11.6 amp hour with the Samson cells, which was about 277 pounds with free shipping and took about 50 days from ordering to delivery. There is an option for quicker delivery if you want to pay extra. After removing the bar, the top and bottom get fitted with two bolts each. The bolts that come with it are too long, so I used some spare shorter disc brake bolts that fit perfectly. I used some blue tack to keep hold of the bottom bolt, as it is tricky to get at and so it doesn't drop when trying to tighten it. A quick test fit with the battery to see if it fits in okay as there's a few millimetres of adjustment on the mounting brackets. I just pushed both brackets down as far as they go then tightened the four bolts. I decided to cut off the battery mount wires and solder the Bafang motor wires directly to it, as there isn't much room below the mount. I had to cut out the back of the lower mount cover to clear the wires. Then I put both mount covers back on and the battery fits in just great. So I sourced a front headlight from eBay which works pretty well for such a low powered LED light. And I had to get a bit creative with the rear light and I used a dual red light which uses two 3 volt batteries which I took out and rewired it so I could use the Bafang rear light wires. And that's it for this video, thanks for watching.